Uh, the last of the Soviet Siberian forces have wandered out into the ice wastes. The ice wastes? That's interesting. Uh, finish off the fortifications so our allied forces will have no trouble moving through this area on their way to Moscow. The mission is complete when all Soviet forces and structures are destroyed. Okay, well, uh, let's just head down here, see if we got a nice base to build. Oh, yeah, we got some V2s to start off. Oh, I see gems! Oh, nice. Oh, I got a second one? Why do I get a second one? Do I get to build a second base? We're gonna go find a second base. Uh, refinery. Turbo Shark lost. Construction complete. Yes, sir. Affirmative. Cannot detect area. New construction options. Building. Unit ready. Uncool field. The bot commands for this channel are available at. There you go. I don't even know what the commands are, to be honest. I've done with rivals. What do you mean, Funky? Unit ready. Yes, sir. Like command and conquer rivals. Very well. Yes, sir. Vehicle affirmative. Yeah, CNC yes, rivals sir. is broken. Yeah, so that is definitely taking the name of command and conquer and milking it for everything that it can, because that was not made by anyone from the original Westwood. That's not a labor of love. That's not. That's just taking the name. That's EA using the name, which is kind of unfortunate. Oh, yes, get out of there. Get out of there. Get out. Are you going to follow me? Oh, well, we killed them all. It's actually a decent game. It's balancing is just awful. Yeah, and balancing on an RTS game is incredibly difficult to do. Unit ready. Training. Yes, sir. Unit ready. Hello, you're yes, getting sir. fired at. Construction there you go. Yes, sir. Construction options. Building. Building. Turbo says red alert 2 at 1080p is, is beautiful. It is pretty nice, and we'll get to that, I promise. Yes, we will get to that point. Complete. Speaking of balancing, try the shockwave mod for Command Element and Conquer. Like for the original OG Command and Conquer. I've been running everything like vanilla the only change that I've done is just uh, so that I can run high def or run the higher resolution all right <coughs> let's uh, let's base walk this mother this monster trucker Uh, silo. I'm not sure what this other. I'm not sure what this other um, MCV is for. Let's uh, let's head over here. Funky says there's a red alert mod for Renegade. That's good. I have so that's one I haven't played. Where? Where are these? Oh, there they are. I have not played Renegade. That's one I did not pick up. I don't know if it was because my parents wouldn't allow me to play um, wouldn't allow me to play uh, first person shooters back when I was like eight or nine. There we go. I'm not sure. Turbo Shark says nice weather here, having sunny skies, calm waters, and a nationwide quarantine. Well, at least it's nice yes, while you're being quarantined. It's not uh, it's not terrible out. <coughs> Let's see how big this mission or this level is. Oh, so it's fairly big. Can you head down here, Southmore? What do we see? I'm trying to see where I should set up another shop. I mean, we might as well go right here. I'm thinking. 
Oh, that's a base down there. Okay. Building. Yes, sir. Yeah, we'll we'll set up shop right up here. I think we'll do that. Affirmative. Uh, let's see. Talking about if we want to talk about uh, Corona. We're um, here in Canada. The government announced a billion dollar, um, a billion dollar package or whatever, so that we can combat Corona. Yes, sir. Um, so I, I don't. I think it mostly goes to like healthcare people, so that they can combat against uh, against it, and whatnot. But. Um, we, we don't have a whole lot of cases. I'm on the West Coast, which is British Columbia. We are the main central hub, yes, actually, to uh, China. So we have, I think, under maybe 50 cases, under 20 cases. It's a really surprisingly no, low number, um, considering how close we are, like how many flights we have come in from China. It's really interesting to see how well our country has done in preventing... Um, preventing more infections from happening. So we have had like some, just a, I think we had our first set of schools closed down today and they were private schools um, primarily that have Chinese people in them. Um, so, so Phil, I'm with you. It's, I mean, they declared it a, um, what do they declare? They declared it something today. So it's, um, it is what it is. People don't necessarily, I don't think it's something you need to freak out unless it, unless there's a mutation that comes up and that mutation causes it to start impacting unhealth or normally healthy people. That's, that's the part that I would start to worry. Right now we have healthy people that it's not affecting um, it's, you know, the people that are dying are old people. I want to catch up on chat here. Uh, there's an interview guy with a guy that made it out, and it's pretty neat. Yeah, so Joe Rogan had a really good interview with one. Uh, I watched that today. It's about an hour and a half long. I think that one was quite good. Um, oh, I'm from West Coast, too. So, hi, El. Cool. Whereabouts are you from? Are you in the Lower Mainland? I am. I am in the Lower Mainland. Absolutely. Uh, you should meet so okay I'm not going outside <laughs> I was at Costco today you were brave you were brave going to Costco today uh, I think my sister my sister also lives here in the lower mainland and she went to Costco today and she uh, she's like she called up my wife and she's like um there's no toilet paper here so people are really going crazy even here at Costco even though we have barely anybody that's actually uh, sick it's kind of kind of crazy what people are doing um, you're at Costco to call an Uber. It's portable indoors. People were buying all the toilet paper. Yeah. Yo, that same, uh, yo, same. That video was awesome. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. So that's the same one. Actually, I ran out of toilet paper today and went to buy some. It was nuts. So, um, we, we got groceries this week and I was thinking that, you know, we, we weren't going to get any toilet paper or whatever with everything's going on. Um, we shop at Superstore in South Surrey. Um, anyway, so my wife comes home and she's got toilet paper. And I was like, wait, I'm thinking in my head, I, we didn't actually have a conversation, but I was thinking in my head, I thought, you know, we we're, everyone was freaking out and there's no toilet paper anywhere. But no, if you just go to, um, that one, it's, uh, it was fine. <laughs> they, had, they had plenty of toilet paper. It wasn't being sold. Did you guys see the, the picture of the vending machine or the, the you know, those claw, uh, stuffed animal machines um they had a, one of those and it was stuffed with toilet paper <laughs> oh man two three bucks a roll that's uh that's pretty insane just use soap and water sandpaper if you're feeling brave well yeah soap and water is the best thing that you can do one of the things i found out as well about the coronavirus is that um it uh is one of the viruses that is susceptible to hand sanitizer so that's good so if you really need to have a, a deep clean or whatever hand sanitizer will work for you so that's that's positive news that's that's good to hear um i guess we'll get one of these built so uh so heil 
Whereabouts in the lower mainland are you? Ready. Construction complete. Uh, where do I want to put this? I guess we'll throw it down here. Options. You can buy a house in BC if you have a bottle of hand sanitizer. <laughs> yeah, probably right about now. It's pretty crazy. You're from Poco. Oh, nice. Uh, I've got a friend. Uh, one of my best friends live in Maple Ridge, so that's pretty good. So I used to play hockey yes, at the uh, Planet Ice there, Board just over the Port Man. Yes, sir. Acknowledged. Reporting. Acknowledged. Building. Uh, we should build a camel pillbox down here. Let's get get back out of here. Get out of here. Building. Construction complete. Surprise! Are you gonna go? You're going up this way? We're gonna have a surprise for you up there too. By the time you get there. I can't be the only viewer on here that wants these two to meet. Which two? Me and Sohail? Dude, there's like three million people down here. <laughs> It is it is highly unlikely that uh, under normal normal circumstances we would meet, unless we're going to like a command and conquer convention or something. Yeah, just drop those guys right there. They're gonna die. They also got better infantry. The flame infantry are so awesome. Yes, sir. I love yes, it. Sir. Turbo says, uh, w will you make this happen? What are the chances of stumbling across someone in the same city that plays Command and Conquer 2? I play Command and Conquer 2. Yeah. Uh, yes, sir. Those, that's pretty low. Or the, the, the chances of that are pretty low. Not going to lie. Unless Twitch has like some super sweet algorithm to be able to find people uh, based on your location, you never know. Oh dear, where where are these guys going? We're gonna build some rocket soldiers. Oh, we got one. <laughs> nice, that worked. Unit ready. Training. Unit repaired. Unit ready. Building. Feel like this is going so slowly. Construction complete. Build that back up. Unit ready. They're mostly complete. just Building. sending troopers. Like, they don't even give me a chronosphere. Building. Oh, I got helipads this time. Okay, well, that's positive. We're going to build Building. We're gonna build a whole bunch of helipads. Vehicle reporting. Affirmative. Reporting. You can go get this stuff. All right. Okay. Yes, so, uh, so Heil, are you which command and conquer? I'm one of two people here that enjoy. It. Well, you know, you're not you're not one of two people, Turbo. We have more than two people here that are enjoying. We've got. Uh, I can't scroll out, but we've got we've got lots of people. We've had uh, I think maximum on the stream we've had about thirty watching. So thirty people enjoying command and conquer. That's a pretty good number. Building, building. <clears throat> Awaiting orders. Construction complete. Building. La la la. I grew up playing C Command and Conquer. I used to play at my dad's store. Nice. Building. That's awesome. I grew up playing it too. Ready? So, do you remember the ta the so if you grew up playing Command and Conquer, you'll probably remember these days if you ever played like with your buddies online. Um so you used to you used to plug in your phone modem on hold. Uh so that you could play together. So, and you yes, in Command and Conquer, you would uh, you know, put in your friend's phone number and then it would dial out, but it would actually ring their phone. And it would wouldn't pick up until yes, uh, like the third ring or whatever. Yes, so I can I can remember every time I'd go to play, we'd uh, yes, my friend always wanted to call me, and so every time <coughs> I think it was because maybe his mom was sleeping or his dad was sleeping. I'm not sure. Anyways, so every single time that uh, we would play, he'd call me. 
and the phone would ring and inevitably half the time my mom would like pick up the phone so what I would end up having to do is I'd be yelling at my mom saying mom don't pick up the phone right when it's ringing and my sisters would hear me and everyone would hear me yelling don't pick up the phone stop picking up the phone okay that was, brings back brings back fond memories of that that's for sure uh, Turbo Shark says, I grew up playing. Oh, where's that? Turbo Shark says, I grew up playing Red Alert 2. That was my best only friend for most of my life. <laughs> Alright. I had to play Red Alert. We didn't have internet, it was all LAN parties. Construction complete. So you could do a LAN party with dial-up? I never, I don't ever remember that. We had, you didn't necessarily have to have, I don't think we had to have internet. It did like a connection to connection. So you just, you just plugged, a, it, if you had a modem on the back of your computer, you would just plug it in and it would directly connect with it. It would detect the modem and, and plug it directly in. Construction complete. Unit ready. Building. You poke the bear. So you basically, yeah, plug the two PCs together. Okay, so it's probably the same thing. It's a really similar idea. Can you maybe go over here? You guys are going to squish. Couldn't afford a PC till a few years later. Yeah, I mean, I was on my parents' computer. Which was, uh, I remember it being like the slowest of all my friends. That's for sure. I I ended up borrowing um, a copy of Windows 98 from my cousins who had gotten a newer computer. So that I could install Windows 98 so that I could get the higher resolution because it supported... High resolution. I think we also had to buy an actual video card, and it was like a four megabyte megabyte voodoo card from from back in the day. Funky says I had to play Red Alert with a friend using two PS ones, two CRTs, and a PS one link cable. <laughs> That's pretty crazy. All right, let's go. Uh, Let's get out of here. Yeah, you guys do some work there. Let's let that camel box do some work, okay? Let's put another one here. Four megabyte graphics card. Graphics card. Yep, the Voodoo back in the day. And I remember if you got a good one, it was like eight, eight megabytes. Those were the good old days. I mean, those were the good old days. A friend of mine also had, there was a Star Wars game that, um, there was a Star Wars game that you could play and it had a, he had a joystick and everything. Leave my poor truck alone. Come get this stuff, okay? We're gonna get a wicked, wicked awesome, um, what are they called? Fleet. Yes, sir. Yeah, sweet fleet going here. Let's just go blow this up. I'm kind of worried about it. There we go. I feel better about that now. Yes, sir. Affirmative. Affirmative. All right. I want to go. Um, well, first off, I think let's save. So CSLI seven dash or eight dash one. It's related. So, oh, we need a backup. We need some backup. Yes, sir. Affirmative. What's this? That's money. Okay. Uh, so Heil, I started using PC when XP was out. I think that was seven when I found Command and Conquer. Yes, sir. Yeah, I definitely. I'm pretty sure I still played it when uh, XP came out.
The nice thing about this game is I really don't remember it like lagging. No, oh, we're fine there. I don't really remember it lagging a whole lot. I mean, yes, it did lag, but I don't remember it lagging a lot. These guys, just squish them. It looks to be running surprisingly well. Yeah, I mean, it's an old game. They they did have to do a little bit of configuration to make sure that it would run on new CPUs because the original clock speed was tied directly to your CPU speed. So you could have very, very uneven games if you're playing with your friends. We're going to build some anti-infantry here. And also a couple of camel pillboxes here for when they come in. I really wish I could get a tech center so I get a spy satellite because that would make this level a heck of a lot easier because then I could just take my fleet. That's all I want to do. I guess when these guys get healed We'll, uh, Primary building. Selected. Building. we'll build another one. We've got the cash. Get Unit this building ready. faster. Building. Unit prepared. Acknowledged. Unit ready. Unit prepared. Yes, sir. Prepared. Construction complete. All right. Unit prepared. Go right there. We'll squish him. Yes, sir. Problem solved. Construction complete. Repaired. <clears throat> uh, so Heil, how, how do I pronounce your name? Am I doing that okay? Uh, how long has, how long have I been streaming for? Uh, this stream has been live for. Three hours and 22 minutes. Uh, overall, in total streaming, I just started like a week ago. About a week ago or so. I think that's about it. So, very, very short period of time. Um, I've been watching stream streams for a nice long time, but uh, haven't been streaming myself. But, I mean, I'm, I think I picked it up pretty quick. Like, I can use my DSLR that I would take photos of my kids with. I got a light. I got a green screen. So, overall, I think doing okay. But it's uh, it's a load of fun. I, I, I will tell you that much. I have a blast doing it. Because I get to have people like you come and chat. And we get to talk. And uh, this guy's like Tom. Tom, uh, last week, we got a donation from him. Which was pretty, pretty rad. Um... The PlayStation CPU didn't handle it very well. The slowdown was insane, especially on skirmishes. Yeah, I bet this. I bet that would have been pretty slow. Hmm. Do you have a set time for when you start streaming? So typically, um, Turbo, my my schedule is Monday, Wednesday, and then either Friday or Saturday, depending on what my my wife and uh, me want to do for date night. So sometimes we'll go out Friday, sometimes we'll go out Saturday, depends on where if we can get a sitter or whatnot. Um, so, but that's that's typically my schedule. Last night I had a what I'm calling bonus stream. Um, my wife went out to go meet someone on Instagram, and uh, so uh, I was at home, put the kids to bed, and. Uh, There was Ori, Ori in the and the blind, or sorry, Ori and the Will of the Wisps uh, came out last night, so I was playing that because uh, that was a really fun game. So I started doing Twitch just five days ago. Okay, well in that case, hang on, what do I need to do here? Can I click on your name? I'm gonna click on your name and I'm going to. Can I follow you? Click on your profile. I'll give you a follow. Cause. What do you need as followers to start off with? So I'm happy to do that. Tom Tam, please. I'm just taking a quick break to take the car to the shop. 
Oh no, what's wrong with your car? What's wrong with your car? I had to take my car to the shop a couple weeks ago, get a clutch, timing belt, water pump, oil change. It was an expensive trip. Yes, sir. Acknowledged. New clutches are uh, never all that fun. But the good news is, is that my dealership wanted about $3,000 to do it, and I found a local shop just around the corner, and he did it for like a third of that price. My actual channel is so chill. Oh, so you're so chill. I'm so confused. So you're so chill? We had we had a guy so chill. That was you, right? Yeah. Okay. So no, so this is just like a secondary account then. You're messing with me. I had no idea. All right. Uh, before we go in, we're gonna save. Mission. You got two accounts. Super sneaky. So you have like the one. The ones that uh, you're okay with uh, everyone seeing who you follow and the ones where you're not. Here we go. Let's walk in. Let's go get the power. I'll get chat in just a sec. I see it. I see it pinging. We want to get their power so the Tesla coils come offline. Okay, I think we did it. This is good. Okay, that was a good sacrifice, boys. Guard, just guard for now. Alright, now we send in the choppas. You know what? Uh, let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. Go repair. Oh no! There we go. Uh, let's go destroy them. Okay, Tom 10. Frontless suspension is messed up. And the light for the passenger airbag is lit. Okay. Oh, come on, did we get it? So close. Building. I want this to be primary. Unit ready. Affirmative. Unit repaired. Yes, sir. Oops, uh, what was it? Okay. Repair? Nope. T. Uh, that's kamikaze move I've seen in a non Japanese person to do. It wasn't kamikaze, not everybody died. We need more though. We definitely want more. We got the cash. Do you have any streaming tips? Um, so I guess it depends on what type of, of uh, tips you're looking for. I would say, oh, we got a zap here. I would say first and foremost, just get down like um, a schedule. See, see what schedule you can commit to. My stream is very premium. Ho oh, ho, thank you. <laughs> I, that, that means a lot to me. What what makes you think that my uh, my stream is premium? And yes, be nice. If you can, so I've been watching, I would say probably if you can, find some guys that are super nice, that you enjoy, that are super chill. Um, one of the guys that I watch on a daily basis, he's a Canadian as well. His name is Slade. I have a green screen, okay. So a green screen, um, a green screen is really gonna only help if you have a decent camera. You'll notice, like for me, I've sort of I made the decision to say, okay, I'm okay. Ha like I can get a green screen, and I can get a light for my face. That was one thing that was really big, uh, getting a light for my face. Um, but I just got those this past week um, after I sort of saw the success of having um, people in the stream. Um, so the light and the green screen, I think total was $200. Um, they aren't anything fancy, but I had some birthday money that uh, I hadn't spent on uh, any Nintendo Switch games. So 
it just it worked out quite well uh, just to be able to use that you may not be that fortunate but a light on your face definitely helps uh, significantly that, that's one that I would say really helps the green screen um, you can pick up if you have like a, a wall that you can just hang it uh, a green screen uh, will you can pick up just the green screen for 30 bucks and you can hang it uh, hang it up my birthday money went missing oh no that's terrible um, let's see the other thing the hardest part probably is lighting the screen like if I m leave the frame um, the you'll you'll notice that my cam here I'll do it I'll do it for you but if I leave the screen you watch my camera when I leave this the screen here watch the background you'll see it fades in and of course it's not doing it right now but it was doing it really more noticeably so that has to do with the lighting of the screen so what I ended up doing is I just grabbed a couple lamps and just put them behind me on the floor to light up my screen and then I have an overhead light um, that shines actually off my head and into the camera. That's why I wear a hat. If I take this off and uh, it shines right into the camera so I don't do that. I'll have a hat until I can get better lighting and remove uh, remove that overhead light. I have a mic and a webcam that's Silence basically it. Needed. I don't get Building. the joke. I did miss Building. the joke. Building. Unit ready. What was the joke? Unit if you have to tell a joke, if you have to like tell someone what the joke is, Unit you know they do say building. that you you've kind of missed the boat. They really really want to get that service depot. Building. Um. So yeah, Unit being nice ready. that's a good one. Uh, picking a schedule. Uh, <laughs> yeah, explaining a joke does really kill it. Building. Absolutely, hundred percent agree. I think that's the irony. Okay, let's go. Uh, let's go get their cash. Uh, let's see what else. Unit ready. We're gonna. I'm just noticing my followers here. Gotta move that back up. Not sure why that went down. Hey, we hit 50. Yay! We hit 50. That's exciting. Thanks, everyone. That uh, that didn't take too long. Um, f so other things are like find a game you're good at. Um, find a game that you enjoy, that you're going to have a lot of fun streaming with. All, all those things. And um, don't look at the, the numbers to start. Awaiting order. Um, they'll... They'll, they will frustrate you, 100%. Yeah, he saw me at 48 and had to get me to 50. Well, I appreciate that. Now you get a, a cut of advertisement from Twitch. Oh, no. Now there's going to be ads on my stream. Have there been ads for you guys? Have there been ads when you, when you load up? I still have to apply. Like, this just happened tonight. So they may, they may require, like, oh, you have to be streaming for at least 30 days or... I'm not sure. I'm not sure what they're going to require me to do and fill out an application and probably some, um, probably some sort of uh, banking info and whatnot. How I want to get paid? Because I mean, this is not a, this is not a paid gig by any means, other than great people like Tom, generous people like Tom, my sweetest friend. Oh yeah, there's a registration. Yeah, okay. Um, so yeah, just, I would watch streams, I mean, try to be you, that's the biggest thing, people are here for you, some people like having their face in front, some people don't, um, I for one, like, I'm comfortable talking to people and, you know, doing presentations and whatnot, I've done lots of public speaking in the past and I spent, um, I spent a good part of a, a year and a half just at trade shows trying to do some sales stuff for a, a HoloLens application that uh, that I had built. So I got used to just talking to people and just be yourself, be a nice guy, and everything will be good. Uh, and it just takes time. That's, uh, that's probably the biggest thing. Be patient, and you'll get there. I'm sure you'll get there. 
you're free to share your income. <laughs> well, you know, one of the things I thought with uh, with the stream is like for me, this is just fun. I'm not here to make money. I have a day job. Um, I own a software engineering firm. So, you know, I thought maybe most of what I would do is the revenue that does come in either goes to like getting a new mic. Like that's that's probably the last thing that I would want to get is a uh, a light and a, a microphone. And then that's that's probably about it. Um, this is this is nice. It's an okay mic, but uh, it's not it's not the greatest by any means. But um, yeah, I thought you know that between the the money, any money that I earn from the stream, I'll uh, almost inevitably just invest it either back into subs on Twitch, uh, or and and I have a lot of um, you know try to find a lot of friends, you know lower guys like me that um, are. You know, if I can give them, if I can give them a sub, then then I'll give them a sub because why not, right? We're we're all in this together. I I definitely was able to learn fairly early on that um, you know the competitiveness. It's better to be friends than than enemies, for sure, like hundred percent. Let's go uh, destroy these. Uh, charisma is a big part of streaming, and you're really good at talking and idle commentary. Not always. Like I have my moments where I'm not, <laughs> I'm not at my best. It what really helps is having you guys here. Like having you guys here and having you guys talking is probably the best thing to keep me going. Like the more people that we have, the more uh, that it makes it easy just to just to continue talking with people. Income goes to make the stream better, municipal savings. Yes, sir. Who, where, where is that V2? I heard a V2. Awaiting orders. Affirmative. Unit ready. Building. Reporting. No, just blow him up. Unit ready. Just blow him up. Building. There we go. Yes, sir. He's done. Affirmative. Are you guys stuck there? No, you're not. All right. Awaiting orders. Come on up here. Building. On hold. Cancel. <laughs> I mean, savings right now. <laughs> savings is always tough right now because of Corona. Like, I had put in my annual um, RSPs and whatnot just right right before things started to go down. I hit some as like when they were down, so I didn't take as much of a hit, but it was definitely frustrating to see. Better to make friends than enemies. Tried and tested. Can confirm that this works. I've gotten out of a ton of assignments just because of making friends with the teachers. Oh yeah. For sure. So one of my uh, teachers uh, actually the, the thing that we had in common was that uh, we both lived in the same neighborhood. So he'd be out walking his kids and I'd be out riding my bike and he'd say hi but um, so we, you know, his kids went to the same elementary school that I did and uh, but the thing I loved about him is he, he worked at a company called Nortel, which uh, was a networking company back in the 90s. And they had this big, massive, they did the dot-com, like, bust. They just fell hard. So he was heavily involved with designing cellular towers for um, uh, for the cell phone networks back in the 90s. And it was great. He was telling us about the story. He's like, okay, one of the big problems that you need to figure out is how do you transition you know, a device from tower to tower? without dropping the signal. And uh, we had this one, uh, we'll call him, a, he was a book smart guy. Where, where are you? Okay, you're just firing on. We had this one guy, we'll call him a book smart guy. And um, he called him out and he's like, this isn't, this is pointless, this is useless, like you don't know what you're talking about. And uh, I remember sitting in class, I said, no, 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 like, just be quiet, man. You do realize like this is literally what he did as a profession before he started teaching. <laughs> <laughs> and then he, he kind of was quiet, but it's really funny how, you know, people, just because they read something in a book, they, they know it all. Uh, I did finish them later, though. I just happened to forget to bring it into class on occasion. I trust you. I trust you. Don't worry. Whoops. That was, that was a bad idea. Let's get some more helipads. Because why not, right? 
My favorite math teacher left. Been pretty bummed since. I wish I could meet him again. I heard something blow up. Oh, they blew up the turret. Um, so my math teacher. I had I had some of the best math teachers. Uh, in university. Let's go go destroy him. Um, I wasn't, so I actually, um, I was quote unquote, if you want to say it, so smart that I got to skip grade two. So I graduated the year ahead. Would I please say Tom 10? It's sweetest short for Santa Claus. So it's like someone shortened Santa to San. Is it really? Okay. I'm going to, I'm going to check on that. We're going to open up Google Translate. We're going to open up Google Tra Tom, this one's going to be on you. Tom 10. <laughs> You're making me say Santa? That's uh that's pretty funny if it is. Okay. Let's get uh <clears throat> let's get this picture on here. Oh, OBS disconnected. I'm still here. I am still here. There we are. We should be back now. Can you see me? Everyone there? I just love how every time I refresh the stream, I have to lose the entire freaky track. I know. I wish that it pulled the history. That is that is a feature Amazon needs to invent. Amazon, if you're watching or you're going to watch, you need to make it so that when you pop into chat, it loads the chat. Like, that's not a hard thing to do. Mixer does it? Oh, snap. If Mixer does it... Oh, <laughs> if Mixer does it, that's terrible. I'm a big, uh, I'm a big Microsoft fan, by the way. Okay, so I need to get Google Translate on here. So let me, um, let me just add a window capture. And, well, everything went dark. Google Translate. Here we go. Okay, so we want pack your bags. We're leaving. No, don't leave. You're welcome to leave. That's up to you. Okay, so let's go Santa Claus from English to Swedish. Okay, that does not look anything like Santa Claus. Or Santa Clausul. Okay, so if we look at San, if we just do San, San is San. Santa. I know, but that Google, which is never wrong, <laughs> Google is never wrong. Santa, well, that's Stanta. Santa is Santa is what it's saying. <laughs> uh, I'm going to allow that funky. Why not? <clears throat> Check Tom 10 Fiom Swedish. Okay. Tom, 10. Oh, I guess I have to go the other way, don't I? Uh, what happened? Swedish. Swedish detected. Okay, it's to English. English. Okay, Tom, 10. Fiam. This is not going to be bad, are you? Oh, I saw Santa there. Santa Fiam. What's Fiam? On OBS, are you screen recording or game recording? Um, I am... <clears throat> what am I doing? I think I am window recording. I believe I'm window recording. I had uh, just Tom 10. Yeah, so Tom 10 does go Santa. No, it goes Sights. Sights. That's interesting. Um, but if you go Fiam... It, it does go to Santa. So that's, that's very interesting. 
Just Tom 10. I know, I did Tom 10. And it switched just to sites. What am I doing? I don't know what you tell me. <laughs> anyway, Tom 10. I've said your name. Is that is that adequate? Um, <clears throat> oh, we got chat there now. <laughs> uh, I wanted that window to match. Exactly. There we go. Try your name in Google Translate from English to French. My name? And have it pronounced in French? Oh, geez. If it's bad, if it says something bad, I'm going to ban you. <laughs> do you want, do you want that? <clears throat> Is this worth it? I feel like, I feel like you're trolling me here. So crazy tagger to en français. Here we go. Crazy tagger. That sounds, that sounds romantic. Crazy tagger. <laughs> French accent. Okay. Crazy Tiger. <clears throat> All right. Um, so, sorry, just getting back to the OBS, <clears throat> uh, the OBS screen recording. So, I tried a number, hang on. I tried a, <clears throat> a number of different options to try to get it to do game capture, and it never... It never really worked for me all that well. I could never seem to get it um, to actually get anything. <clears> hmm. <throat> what about a Japanese accent? Oh, crazy Tega! How's that? Was that okay? <clears throat> Funky says, "Okay, so if you go to settings, you can select pop out chat, and that keeps the chat if you refresh. However, that will wipe the chat one more time if you try it." Yes, because then... <clears throat> okay, but so even if you pop it out, it will refresh. That's surprising. <clears throat> but I understand when it loads it, that's actually considered a refresh. It doesn't take, like, the window <clears throat> and open it up into a new. Realistically, what it should do, it should actually copy. It should copy the contents over or whatnot, but... Anyway, it doesn't... Uh, let's see. Yes, sir. Go get him. Um, <clears throat> yeah, but after that, I'll keep the chat from then on. Yeah. <clears throat> but if you're coming into the stream for the first time, <clears throat> like, got something in my throat here. Hang on. If, if you're coming into chat for the first time, you can't, like, catch up. And you have to, like, remember to do that and having a pop-out. That's never fun. Um, Funky says, I'm new to Twitch, so this is weird that the best streaming platform doesn't do the most basic thing. It's, it, you know, it's really funny how the simplest things don't exist on some platforms. It is, it is truly funny. Right, you think Twitch. Twitch can literally do anything. So, <clears throat> I am not doing that, Fuel. That is not happening. One, two, three, four, I declare Clone War. Five, six, seven, eight, the seven will decide your fate. <laughs> Go get the V2. There we go. Um, I was going to say the other thing. Oh, the other thing that I thought um, people do really enjoy when... Uh, when you are streaming, it is beneficial to read the chat, like to indicate, like, yeah, uncool fool, uncool Phil said something, and repeating the question. People generally respond fairly well to that, um, because a lot of times <clears throat> they don't. Uh, if the chat's moving really quickly, and uh, they don't have the, the the context, you know, they're coming to the party late or whatever. It's it's more difficult to to understand. Does your chat make notification sound? It does not. I have to keep an eye on it. Um, if it made a notification sound, then it would ding through the audio that you would hear. So it does not because of that. Affirmative. Affirmative. <clears throat> Thank you.
Thanks for looking. It to Tolman Santa Claus, Tom Ten Santa. Um, site. So thanks for reading my whole name. I appreciate it. Yeah, no problem, Tom. Tom Ten. I don't know if there's a whole bunch of Swedish people laughing at me right now. They very well could be. Turbo Shark, don't lie. Yes, Turbo Shark, don't lie. It's good to be an honest person. Alright. You guys, come help me out here. You don't know who you're talking to. You're right, we don't know who you're talking to. You are an internet stranger. And you know what they say about stranger danger. Right? Stranger danger. Let's just guard here. I never lie. Never. Even if you had a girlfriend, she says, "Does this does this dress make me look fat?" You're not gonna say, "No, you look beautiful in it." Regardless, I think most most people would uh, carefully choose their words. Strangers get stitches. Well, we beat this level. Girlfriend? What girlfriend? I never had one. Well, maybe that's why. I don't know. I'm not getting into people's personal lives. And I don't want to offend anyone. Um. So Heil. Or so... One of the things other... Uh, stay out of politics or as best you can. Mission accomplished. Can we squish them? Can we send an army to squish them? Alright. There we go. Mission accomplished. I enjoy living a pretty honest life. Yeah. Me too. Me too. Uh, stitches are danger. Snitches are danger. You sound like you're in a gang. Okay, so it lags this time. 